Well, hey, hi. Thanks for uh, stopping by Camp Wounded Dog Workshop. For those of you that aren't familiar with us, we uh, restore and uh, build a reproduction of the Coleman 316 Arc Lantern. Also make reproduction parts for guys. One of the issues we've been having is that the replacement globes are no longer available, um, at least not at present. So everybody's looking for them. The foundry has uh, sort of I guess put us on the back burner because of COVID and all that they're not really all that excited about making us a run of globe so in the meantime I've come up with something that's a pretty good replacement it works it's not exactly like the original globe but visually it looks the same so I'm gonna show you what it is and we're gonna be offering these on eBay this is an original 316 with an original globe the only globe I got right now has got a crack in it so anyway what we had to do was find something that we could substitute the original globe with that would look pretty much like the original when it was installed. Um, I was able to find a company that can supply me with a heavy glass 10 inch globe. But the thing was there was no hole in the bottom. So I had to come up with a gadget, uh, a jig and a diamond hole saw to cut a hole in the bottom of this. Now the thing is this hole is slightly smaller than the globe rest. So in order to keep the globe stabilized I had to come up with an adapter ring. See the adapter ring goes in then your globe goes on over the adapter ring and will sit on your let me make sure I got everything square here will sit on your globe rust the way it's supposed to. Then you put your vent cone on. And this is critical. You always, whether you're using a regular globe or one of these substitute globes, you gotta have your vent cone on to direct the heat. Now the problem is these clips in your shade are gonna make your globe sit a little bit higher. So you have two options. You can flatten these clips out so it sits lower, or I supply a riser nut that goes on here. And will elevate where your shade sits on the lantern. So there you go. That's, that's a pretty decent... And I'm not saying it's a reproduction part. Don't, don't get me wrong. This is a replacement uh, replacement part. We've, we've tested this. As long as you got your vent cone in there, it handles the heat from the mantles perfectly. So that's what we got. We'll be selling these. What you get in the kit is... Let me get this apart here. You get the riser nut, you get the globe which has been cut, and you get the adapter ring. So that's it. So that's what Camp Wound Dog Workshop is doing for you guys that are looking for uh, globes for your 316. Um, it's a, you know it's a pretty decent tweak. As I said, it's not an exact reproduction but it works really good and unless you tell somebody what you're doing they won't know it's not original alright thanks for stopping by Camp Wound Dog Workshop y'all have a real good day bye bye